The badminton matches took place over Monday and Tuesday evening, with competitors from all teams taking part in a combination of singles and doubles matches. So Zoe, badminton is your thing, so how did you get on here? Um, very well today. I, I have enjoyed myself. I've won, won the games that I've played today. So yeah, very good. Who was your last game against? Uh, my last game was against Bill Chater and Nacho, I believe he goes by. Yeah. And that was the score? Um, the score... I don't know. <laughs> it was a big score, wasn't it? <laughs> it it was, was a big score. <laughs> a big score, yeah. They did very well. It was, it was a good challenge. Badminton, your sort of thing? No, no, not played it for a very, very long time. You did very well though, you've yeah. got some smashes in there. More luck than judgment, I think. Um, how have you been finding the tournament so far? Good, good. Yeah, no, it's been good. It's been good fun. How did your badminton match go? Uh, I didn't win it, but uh, it was the first badminton match I've ever played in my life, so considering that it wasn't too bad. Um, my partner Andrew did really well, he's, I think he's played before, <laughs> um, but no, it was really good fun, I really enjoyed it. And how's Polar Seafish going? We're doing alright. Um, You're top at the moment. <laughs> I think, yeah, I think we're, <laughs> we're top of the league. <laughs> No, we've um, all been trying our best and having a go at everything pretty much, so yeah, it's been a real team effort. Polar Seafish won big at Badminton with three wins, earning themselves six points for the table. And Essene came second with two wins and added four points to their total. In third place was Fortuna, earning themselves two points with one win, and to round off was Aquila, 